Hey, welcome back. It's Brad Taylor at Taylor Coach. Tracy's RB in Millgrove, Ontario, Canada. And we're shooting a video on this particular coach. It's been a while since I've showed a, an updated one or a new version of our uh, smallest coach that we build and the, all the units that we offer. It's our uh, eight foot little L. Um, it's got a lot of great features that we were showing on it. Uh, this is a 2016 model. Uh, you can see it's got the front window. It's still a 6'6 wide. Uh, we've kept a low bowl height on it, so for the smaller automobiles, uh, it's got a bowl height more around that uh, 14 and a half inches, so it fits on a lot of the small automobiles. Other things that we've done to the little eight now, we've got an outside baggage door, so it lets you underneath the, uh, the seat area for access for carrying your power cord and things like that. Um, you got your uh, GFIC receptacle on the outside, it's got the fridge. Um, Let's take you on the inside of it. It's got some pretty neat things we've done on the inside and uh, we'll chat about that. Now we've got you on some of the talk about the inside of the coach. Um, to begin with too, this particular coach when I give you a length on the trailer from the back here right to the tip of the A-frame is eight, 8 foot about 3 inches. Um, the floor on this particular coach is 5 foot 5 inches the complete floor on this trailer. Something else we've done new for 2016 is we've made a uh, six foot four for a ceiling height in the coach so it gives it a little bit uh, more in airiness on the inside and it also gives more room up on the bunk uh, for sleeping capacity up on the bunk. It also has a new radius door in it which has the upgraded screen door so you have the handle on the inside and the out which makes it nice to keep the bugs out of the coach and it also has the BAL stabilizing jacks on it as well on the back here which makes it great so when you're coming into the park and you want to level it really quick because you got to get on and you want other things you want to do with your day makes it very fast and simple. Um, on the inside here mention a few things the particular dinette here when it goes into a bed this makes into a 48 inch wide by 6 foot 3 in length uh, so it'll sleep a couple people down below. You've got the overhead bunk here that we do on all our coaches. Maybe I'll show it so some people haven't seen some of the other ones. It uh, swings down into a bunk here so you can sleep uh, an adult up on the bunk or you can also sleep a couple of kids. We rate the bunk for, uh, for 200 pounds for sleeping capacity on it. Um, when my kids were little, I mentioned to people all the time, we used to sleep basically, you know, an 11-year-old and a 9-year-old up on the bunk at times. You just had to have their heads at opposite sides there so they, you could get along at the same point. It has a little ledge up at the front here for putting your knickknacks so when you go to bed at night, if you want to put your watches or glasses or anything like that, it's a great place to store things while you're sleeping. Okay, we'll get uh, Bob on the inside here and we'll show you some of the other features from there. Okay, to show you the fridges and stuff that we put in it, this has the Dometic uh, 1.7 in a three-way, so it's gas, electric, and 12-volt uh, fridge that's in it. Uh, it does have storage underneath the seats. You've got a little storage compartment as well underneath here. It's got a nice size counter here, so if you want to cook electrically or if you want to have a little portable stove you want to sit inside, you could cook as well. It's got the microwave up above it. So if you want to do cook things by a microwave, you can as well. And you have the option that if you didn't want a microwave, you didn't have to. I don't know if I mentioned, it does have the fantastic fan in this particular coach as well. So it's all thermostatically controlled. And over here where their closet area is, we also have a spot that has a portable john. So you have a bathroom facility on board and that, that you don't have to run out in the middle of the night if it was raining or anything. You just leave the door open to use it. And it does also have a couple reading lights as well for when you're going to bed at night for reading. Um, and this particular coach with all the features that were on it, when we uh, weighed it and put it on the scales, it come in at uh, 895 pounds, which is a tremendous weight with a lot of features like this in such a small coach. Um, and the particular couple we built this for, it's headed out to uh, Seattle, Washington. So it's, it's gonna be on its own journey just to get to its new home. If you got any uh, questions on our product or anything like that, uh, don't hesitate to give me a, a shout. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, my name is Brad Taylor at Taylor Coach. You can email me or give me a call. I look forward to hearing from you. We'll talk soon. Take care. Bye now.